All right, I think I can finally see. I've got this transom in. Man, this has been a lot more work than I thought it would be. If I never have to replace another transom in my life, I will not shed a single tear. I could definitely do one a lot easier than I did this one now that I've done one before because I made a lot of mistakes along the way. But even knowing what I know now, I don't want to replace another one. I mean, you have to have everything just perfect because you have holes in your boat already and those holes have to line up, you know, with your, all your braces and stuff. Man, it's, it's a pain in the butt. I'm still not 100% done with it. I don't have this little tie in all the way. Uh, I need a little bit longer bolt. I wasn't thinking about the width of this plate where it lines up and I don't have the bottom one mounted, but that's okay because I want to sand the bottom of this boat a little bit and then paint it and then I'll put it in. And then I might come back and replace some of these bolts with longer ones, especially these ones in the corner. For whatever reason, they just got flushed and I couldn't put any lock washers on them. But as far as it being in, it's freaking in. Thank goodness. I painted it. You might be wondering why it's brown. I painted it with oil-based paint after I epoxied it. And then I had to trim it a little bit more, but I went ahead and epoxied the raw wood, but I never went back and painted it because I mean, I'm gonna paint all this green anyway, so it'll be okay. I finally feel like I can end the chapter of this boat on the transom. Man, it's been, <laughs> it took me a week to get this transom in, which given a lot of that was waiting on crap to dry. You know, it takes about almost a day for a wool base paint to dry and you had to do one side, flip it over in the same way with the epoxy. And then, like I said, I did it wrong and had to make some more cuts, then epoxy it again, and then wait another day. I'm going to go ahead and run a bead of epoxy along this top edge, too, because it's a little gap in here. Try to keep water from pulling up and collecting in here. But I'll do that when I, whenever I get this brace back in good. But that's not the only thing I've been working on this week. I didn't want to, like, film me jumping around so much. I mean, I have the whole front of the boat. What I think is pretty much framed in the way I want it to, and I also have the front deck cut, the main shape. I haven't laid anything down or whatever, so. And I've got the floor done. Been working my butt off on things. But like I said, I think this transom's done. Whew, it's time for a cold beer.